Uh, but the Bengals, they got the ball back at like the 45. They only mm-hmm. had to go like 20 yards to get into field goal range, uh, yeah. which uh, Zach Taylor on the other side almost messed that up. Hey, man, watch how you talk about Zach Taylor, man. <laughs> I mean, hey, look, the players love him. The players love him. The reason why I've been fading the Bengals all year is because of my lack of respect for Zach Taylor or my, you know, I, I'm not a believer in Zach Taylor, right? The players are. But, man, I mean, how many times are you going to hand the ball off and put it in harm's way before you keep the field goal? I mean, goodness gracious. You got – you got you got a kid you got a kid on the sidelines that y'all drafted in the fifth round, who is known for being the most confident person on the planet. Who said last week before he even went on the field, "Oh well, I guess we're going to the AFC Championship game." The whole the whole thing's on him. Hey, we made this kid. We're going. Hey, I guess we're going. Make oh, as soon as soon as the as soon as they got the pick, he was like, "Oh, I guess we're going to the Super Bowl." Just give it to the 35 coach. Nick Pearson, man. Like, oh, shooter. Like, okay, hey, let's run mix it seven times just in case, you know, we want to try to see if he might fumble it once, you know. Uh, and it's like, guys, dog, bro. So all those shooters. Yeah, man. Shout out to Mick Pearson. Uh shout out to the book. Shout out to that boy uh Ralph too. Uh that's an uh, alumni McPherson from Florida. Yeah, from Florida, dog. Uh, yeah, so. man. Shout out, Ralph, man. Uh, yeah. Yeah, hey, can man. we get some flowers right now? Real quick. Okay. I want to get some flowers. That was a rhetorical question. Thank you very much. Uh, <laughs> I want to give flowers to Coach Johnson for saying that Joe Burrow has the uh, ability to be a top quarterback. My brother, uh, I was recognized at the beginning, maybe the fourth week. That it could have been some truth to that. And, uh, I definitely put some respect on that. Thank you, sir. Thank you. Thank you. Yes. I'm going to be thinking about that lately. I'm like, this dude kind of called this a whole year ago. Um, yeah, yeah. It was it was actually uh, the second week of the season last year. I remember it. I was versus the, after they played the Browns. I was like, oh, this this guy. Okay. Uh, but, uh, yeah, so I, I think it was pretty it was, it was enough for, for those who were watching, it was enough to pay attention and, hey, wait a second. These two, these two last two games they played, they were in the game because of this guy. The team sucked. The only reason they ain't even in the game, he not, he, he's playing terrible, but the only reason in the game is because of him. How, how do you ask a rookie on his second game to throw the ball 60 times? Oh, you got to have something there. So, uh, hey. yeah. <laughs> Joey Craig, man. Shout out to Joey Craig. Yeah man, yeah man. Hey, shout shout no, out, no, shout out to the uh, to the GM two of the Bengals. Uh, I, I forgot to do his name, but hey man, he put he put together a uh, defense on that side of the ball. Though. Uh, he did spend a lot of money on on defense the past couple of years, the past off seasons, and uh, that's a predominantly. Correct me if I'm wrong. I think majority of the guys that's getting burned is like predominantly draft picks, huh? That's getting burnt. For like play time, getting burned. Like on the field. Oh, okay, yeah. Well, uh, I mean, their two biggest stars are are, are on rookie deals, right? So you have your quarterback Joe Burrow, and then uh, uh, Jamar Moss. Chase, right? So they're they're they are relatively very very inexpensive for them. They're getting a lot of production out of those guys. So because they're getting a lot of production out of those guys, they're able to spend money on veterans in other places, right? They spend a lot of money on uh, defensive backs and uh, edge rushers uh, in that D-line. Uh, and so they put together a unit a unit on, on that defense. Definitely not the best in the league, but it is it is definitely adequate uh, for, for – I mean, obviously they're in the Super Bowl, but um, shout, shout out to him, man, for, for putting that together and, um, and utilizing uh, having, a, having a top five quarterback on a cheap deal. So – um, you might see, hey, the Bengals might be, you know, this might not be a fluke. Now, it depends on Zach, on Zach Taylor, but this might not be, might not be a fluke. 